this is Evo Ninja Mama. You are welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time joining me, you are welcome. And if you have been here before, you are also welcome. Guys, I want to carry you. I want to show you people what I did yesterday. Every end of the term, that is when my daughters they want to take holiday, there is this thing they normally do in their school. That's with their classmates. During the term, they will save money or through the term. At the end of the term, which means the last day of the well, the last day of their the last day they will take holiday. They will bring that money together, they will use it to organize something for themselves that they wish to celebrate, either they eat or buy something just to celebrate their holiday and say goodbye to each other. So in this very term now, this Christmas holiday, they decided to say they want to make cake and uh, buy some juice for themselves. Are you guys able <laughs> Niger Baba is always able to do things? So my daughter and their classmates that came to me. My daughter that went to go and tell her in school that uh, my mommy can do keko because I used to do for them at home, just small one they will eat. And uh I decided I did not learn it on I learned it, I learned it from YouTube uh, videos. So even my daughter's birthday, even my daughter's birthday, I was the one that made the cake because the lady told me that uh, the lady that I wanted to uh, wanted to bake cake for my daughter said they should uh, that I should bring uh, I think ten thousand naira, twelve thousand naira for cake. I said, eh, for this uh, art time, no, I don't have that money. So I decided to watch YouTube videos and bring the things, and I make the cake myself. I don't have over at all, but I use my my uh, stove to do it. That was how I did. So because of that one, I was not going to tell her classmate that I can do cake. Then the lad guy that come and make me say, hey, come and do cake for us. So can you do cake? I say, ah, no problem. It's a pleasure. I will do it. So they brought the things and made the cake for them. So the cake. But what pains me most is that. I did not vlog when, when I was doing it. I could not remember at so all. I did not remember to vlog. It didn't pay me. All. I would assure you guys the process of which I made this cake. I know you a lot of you know how to make cake, but this is my process. Eh? If I make one, I laugh. So, but it didn't pay me. Say, so, I'm going to show you guys the cake now. Look at the cake. It's, you guys see it. Look at the cake that I make. If pay me, say, I'm not showing that the, the vlogging. Carry the cake. Let me show you guys where. Look at the cake. So, I'm going to show you guys where. Let me turn. Let me. Feel. So, are you guys seeing it? This is the cake. When I read me, when I read me in the comment section, oh, did I try? Eh? See the cake, oh. And so. Guys, when I don't mind the ass, cut out. This is how we do it every day. No, you people know that I used to set things aside. So every evening, we'll pack all the things inside. Pack them inside. Then the next morning, we'll go and show that so you can see, see all my tomatoes, everything. So this morning, now they are getting ready for school. They are going to... Today is their last day in uh, school. So, success. And in this, uh, why is it that you people always come together uh, during the time? People will gather money together. They are the end of the ten. You people will now use the money to buy something to celebrate together. Why do people always do it? So that we can be together, celebrate our friendship. Then we'll go home and be happy with each other. Eh? Uh -huh. That's why people used to do it. And this thing you put always, but you put share it equally, or how do you put do it? We should share it equally. But you should share it equally. Yes. Are you sure there will be no argument, there will be no fight when people are doing it? No. And people will be happy? Yes. So, what do you feel about this cake that mommy make for you? I feel so happy. You feel so happy? Do you like the cake? Yes. Uh, look at the way you are just standing as if you are a teacher in one place. So, the cake now, come on. I see the... I know they have seen it before, but I carry the cake. Let us see. Okay. I can't. It's too far now. Let me see the cake. So, what are you going to tell your classmate now about this cake? 
Okay. What are you going to tell them? Huh? I tell them that my mommy will bake cake. And you'll be happy? Yes. That your mommy help you to bake cake. Okay. Okay. No problem. Drop your cake. Drop it. No problem. So go and continue. You go and shade it is and get ready to go to school. Uh, as I'm, one of them just came in now. That uh, all of them have the cake together. So Michel, listen. You are shy. Remove your hand. Are you shy? But when you want to talk outside now, you'll be your mouth will be very sharp. So this cake now, why do you people always do this thing? People come together, gather money together to celebrate the end of the day. Why do you people always do it? Because it is for the teachers too. We we'll take out one of the teachers. Okay, you put we'll take the teachers from inside. Yeah. Eh? The people will now share yeah. the remainder. Yeah. When you are sharing the depot, normally argue among yourself. I'm always this big one will take small, this one will take big one. Yeah. The people argue. People don't argue. And people do it with happiness. Yeah. I see Michelle, in the poor of my life, that mama and I build. Okay, this is one of them. They all of them owe the cake together. So carry your cake. Carry your cake. Carry it to your hand. Let me see. So. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. No, I like to fall. Hey, you want to spread the hard work? Oh. The cake will just scatter. So, what are you supposed to tell me now that make the cake for you people? Thank you, ma. Thank you, ma. Mm. Wait, so how did the divide tell you people that uh, people know that I can do cake? The divide that told the people. Am I a baker? <laughs> eh? I'm not the divide that told people that I can do cake. Yes. Okay, oh, no problem. I wish you people all the best in school. I pray your results come. And not only cake, you people go and eat cake in school. Then you people will not forget that you're supposed to carry first. Have a good exams in school. Uh, be a good result. No allow. I wish you all success today. Hello, guys. I'm here again. I beg, I say, I swear, I'm tired. I'm really, really tired. Guys, this video I'm doing now, I just want to ask a question. I just want people to let me know what I should do or with what is happening, so the consequence for me. Like you guys know, when they say I should go and verify my account, so because of that, I believe you guys have a few I've watched my video where I went to do my national ID card from there. How I went to to this team, what they call it, to bank, to do my BVN, all those things, all part down. I believe you guys have watched the video. The stress I went through, going through that thing, going the process of uh, of uh, doing the national ID card. And when I do that national ID card, when I went, I asked the person that is doing it that when will I get the national ID card? He told me that I will get my national ID card within one week. I said, okay, no problem. After one week, I called. How far is the national ID card ready? He said, no, that I should call back in three days' time. I said, okay, no problem. After three days' time, I called. He said, yes, the national ID card is ready. But the issue now is uh, the national ID card is not activated. That uh, I will not be able to use it. I said, ah. Oh, boy. The day when I called there, so I tell you, say, this thing I need urgently. I want to use that to verify something. How long it will take? Now you tell me, say, within seven days. After seven days, you tell me it's after three days again. No, no, I don't call you now. They tell me, say, uh, they never uh, activate. I'm not going to feel user. Ah, they tell me, tire me. And I ask the boy, okay, when will I be able to use it now? He said, uh, after three months. As soon as he made sure that was in my head, then just swear once. He said, what do you mean? 
after three months. Something that I need now, now, now. You're telling me after three months. But you did tell me this one before. I say, hey, okay, wish me he forgot. Huh? It's short, uh, as I was tired. I, I just tired. I just tired with what I just tired with those words that the boy is saying. So I said, What will I do now? Because this year I really need it. He said, eh, There is another way forward. And I asked him, Where is the way forward? He said, eh, If I really need it urgently, that within five days he think I'll be ready. If I can pay some extra money. I was so angry. So I just talked to him anyhow. I said, no, 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 I'm not going to pay any money. I need that thing that I've never had. Where they will say uh, a national ID will stay for three months before to be activated. I just called the court against people because I was really angry. So when I explained to my husband, my husband told me that. Now would they find something nine hand long? If you verse now because of this, which means you don't need it. So you have to calm down, ask the boy what you will do. So I don't told you that. Look at what the boy told me already. He said, what well, you say? There is no, uh, nothing I can do. I should give the boy the money. I said, okay. And I gave the boy the money again. So me not giving that boy that money, I don't know whether the team will really be ready after that uh, uh, five days, he said. So guys, now since they said I should verify my account, now it's over, I think, uh, it's over four weeks now, and I've not verified it. So guys, I'm asking, is, is there, I don't know if they are going to block my account. I'm just confused before that thing will come. I don't know what to do. Is there any time limit for for verification, uh, verification of account? Or what do you guys think I can, I will do? I, because as I mean, I'm just confused because I've worked so hard for, for this, for this my YouTube channel, sleepless night, buying of data, you guys know, for you to upload video in in nigeria is not easy and in my place i suffer for network a lot being a physically challenged mom somebody that cannot work um in short many many things that i cannot that because of in short eh, i don't know what to explain anymore it's really hard for me being a physically challenged mother doing youtube in nigeria I don't have any any specificity that's okay this is what i'm doing to be buying data so i don't if, if i lose my channel where where am i going to start from where am i going to start from because it, it, it's not easy oh, it's not easy i know how i suffer for network if i want to upload video i must wake up by night that by two or three to carry my phone my husband will be to carry my phone to outside to go and look for network in the midnight I will not wake and when you are uploading one video, it can take three to four hours, five hours, six hours to upload a video that is not even more than 10 minutes. So, you guys should help me. Is there any way that I can do this thing? Because I'm really so tired. I'm really so tired. I'm tired. I don't know what to do anymore. I'm confused. So, guys, please, people should just give me advice on what to do. I'm tired. I'm really, really confused. So, if you guys have watched up to this time, you have not subscribed to my channel, please support Ibu Niger Mama. Support me. Thank you guys for watching. God bless.